It's body. right here in yes, your, uh, right top here. of your head. Yes, and then what happens actually, you don't feel sad anymore. The second thing uh, is exercise or rebound. You can buy a, a small trampoline and just rebound on a trampoline. Uh, if you don't have it, because it's very important because your cells start um, vibrating and shaking when you're rebounding and produce more uh, dopamine, which is a pleasure hormone, hormone in your body. Mm -hmm. And uh, the other thing is that eat good food. What I mean by good food is stay away from processed food, stay away from um, fast food. High fructose food. corn yes. syrup. I'm sorry? High fructose corn syrup. Yes, exactly. Yeah, okay. Stay away from that. Stay away from MSG. And just, I'm not saying if you don't have lo lots of money, I understand, but be as close as possible to natural and organic foods. Um, then uh, you, you, you would see the result. Um, and uh, the other thing that you could do is dancing, singing, music are very important. I've seen uh, uh, lots of people who have been diagnosed with depression, this and that, uh, especially uh, in African American community. But they heal themselves through dance, music, and singing, they sing while they're listening to music. Believe it or not, that is the great help. And lots of them are out of trouble, out of any kind of depression, so-called depression. And uh, you could do that too. It's a very safe approach to take. Yes. I was just going to add that a lot of this uh, that Q has been talking about is has been considered just common sense for a long time. I can remember when I was a little girl, I would always tend to, to couch in front of the TV, and my grandma would always tell me, go outside, get some mm. fresh air, get some exercise, stop eating junk food. All of these things that Q has been saying are, are things that I can remember my grandmothers telling me as a little yeah. girl. So I think that these things have been just common knowledge, common wisdom for a long time, but in our modern society, we've definitely lost a lot of those things as time has gone on, and we've become more technologically advanced. Yes, yes, very true. And uh, stay away from, if you could, uh, stay away from uh, uh, magnetic, cha chaotic magnetic uh, field, uh, which has been caused by cell phones, TVs, you name it, anything exactly. electronic. So don't sleep by your cell phone. Uh, try to stay away from it as hard as possible. If you can, then you can uh, buy some of these, uh, I don't know what they call it, Q-bands, uh, or uh, there are certain... Uh, uh, things that you can buy in the market actually and either wear them or you know uh, you can uh, put it on and uh, that reduces or neutralize the chaotic uh, magnetic field uh, yes Jim. Uh, another very wonderful thing that's being pushed more and more uh, by people uh, is uh, meditation oh yes uh, absolutely regular daily meditation I mean I'm uh, uh, only half as insane as I would be <laughs> if I weren't a regular uh, meditator uh, 20 to 30 minutes a day. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. You need your own moment. When you're meditating, uh, for that moment, you're communicating with your own universe because we have an external universe that you're, we are dealing with, but you also have your internal universe, uh, which is you. Actually, you are the universe also. So you need to communicate with that universe on a daily basis, whether you believe in God or not. But that that's, uh, is very helpful. That's why every religion has a form of meditation, uh, which is called prayer, b basically. So uh, that is very important, too. And believe it or not, um, sun gazing is very important. Uh, it has been reported that when we look at the uh, sunset and sunrise, um, we actually get recharged, believe it or not. And that's not a surprise because photons actually has a great effect on your DNAs and also uh, photons uh, energize your body. So 
photons are energy, pa a big, I mean big, a small package of energy uh, in the universe. When the, when the sun is uh, low on the horizon, is it less dangerous to our eyes? Yes, that's why I said sunset and sunrise because of the, you know, uh, the danger that uh, the sun rays uh, might have for you. That's, that was the reason. But on the contrary to what they say, sun is bad for you. No, sun is not bad for you. Uh, so get out when you feel depressed. Um, it's like uh, the... Uh, the more you stay home, the more you get depressed. So you need to break that pattern. Just get out of the house and uh, find an excuse to get out of the house and uh, stay happy. And uh, happiness brings more happiness. I would like to mention one more thing. I'm yes. sorry, Derek. You can oh, go ahead. I, I was just going to say, uh, helping others. You know, getting out of yourself. Thank you. You know, that's 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 one of the absolutely. Key Thank you. For me, is you know, it's like if I'm. If I'm dwelling on myself, I need to go out and help somebody else. Absolutely. Wow, yeah. that was wonderful because... Would you yes. come over and fix my car? <laughs> <laughs> Having a, you know, you know... Go ahead. No, go ahead. No, go I, I just remember this, that um, you can buy even a pet. You can adopt a pet. Uh, keeping a pet is very important. Go and do gardening. Mm -hmm. That is another way of therapy, you know. That's a wonderful way of uh, being happy and seeing great results since since we're going through are we out of time i guess we are out of time i'm hearing the um, closing music but I, I would also since we're going through this litany i'd like to mention vitamins and herbs whole which, food which, whole food which uh, yes. yeah which drug companies despise the whole notion yes. of uh, herbal cures but they uh, people have been using herbal cures for thousands, thousands of years, of years. Exactly. and so i use echinacea every time i have the slightest symptom yes. of any uh, fever or cold or whatever coming on and it helps. I'd just say that under Codex Alimentarius they want the Thank drug you. companies want to ban that and if yes. anybody doesn't know about yes. Codex Alimentarius they should find out it's a UN thing to yes. uh, block those traditional... Thing. They did it in Europe actually. Yeah. They, they want to do it in the US. So people... To block uh, vitamin C, <laughs> aloe vera... Actu they don't know, they want to, they want to using those the, things. The, well, they want to sell the, real the, dro the, or regular drugs. Yeah, they they already blocked the selling the colloidal silver in Europe. Mm -hmm. So be very careful, people. Like we, we don't need the same situation here. Um, thank you so much for watching our show tonight. Thank you, Jennifer. Thank you, Derek. And thank you, Jim. Um, You're the man. Q. Stay tuned. We will come back with more information that they don't want you to know. Thank you and have a good night. All right. Good night. <laughs>